this is the biggest grocery haul we've ever done on my channel. This is gonna be for the whole next month besides some things that we might have to go back and get. It won't even all fit on my kitchen table. We've got meat over here, we've got produce. Don't mind my dishes I didn't do this morning. We've got all of this stuff. This is the biggest haul we've ever shown on here. Cause we usually, we stopped monthly grocery shopping and we started spending too much money. So now we're back to monthly grocery shopping. So we ended up spending $246 and this is all from HEB. Okay, so I'm gonna show you the cold stuff first cause I need to get it put away, it's hot outside. We got some breadsticks, pizza crust, and biscuits. We've got some store brand Velveeta, some string cheese, some fully cooked bacon that I'm gonna use to make breakfast sandwiches. Got some coffee creamer, half and half, butter, peach yogurt that Garrett wanted, gallon of milk. We got this free because we bought green beans. It's a creamy dill finishing sauce. Got some crinkle cut fries, some margarine. Got sausage patties for my breakfast sandwiches along with the cheese. We got some regular hot dogs for the kids' lunches, and then I think Adam's gonna make some homemade corn dogs with these. Got some bread dough. Got some salmon. Bag of corn kernels, and then some sweet corn on the cob. Got some broccoli. Some frozen green beans. And some Brussels sprouts. Mexican blend cheese, Parmesan, shredded Parmesan, two bags of mozzarella, and some eggs. Meat, we've got a big pack of chicken breasts. We have about three pounds of ground beef, some beef stew meat. I think he's gonna use that to make some carne asada. Got some pork chops. Some pork ribs, a pork ribeye roast, and two packs of bacon. So I got the cold stuff put away, now we can move on to these. We got some pinto beans, some brown gravy mix. Got two of these dino shaped macaronis. This is the only macaroni my kids like. I don't know why. I think it's something about the texture. Must be, I don't know. Got some veggie oil. Two big things of chicken broth. Got two of these Jiffy corn muffin mixes. Some refried beans. Two cans of black olives. Mayo. Got some raisins for the boys. Applesauce. Grits. Peanut butter. Always buying peanut butter. We have some apple cider vinegar and honey. Basil pesto. Got some hamburger dill chips. Some pizza sauce. Pork and beans. Some coconut milk that I'm going to use for smoothies. Evaporated milk. Sriracha and Taco Bell mild sauce. Got some Worcestershire. Soy sauce, molasses, some seasoned salt, ketchup, two cans of tomato sauce, two cans of pineapple for smoothies, some of this cheddar cheese sauce. This is what we use to make nachos. We're gonna be using it for a recipe we're making and we already used it for one that's coming up soon. More evaporated milk, more tomato sauce, and refried beans, and pork and beans, and some white hominy. My table is not big enough for all this stuff. Got some saltine crackers, toaster pastries, cherry for Garrett, it's his favorite, pancake mix, 
flour, and some rice. The non-food items, I needed a new brush for the sink, some foil, parchment paper, napkins, and some freezer bags. We also got some paper towels, but I don't see them anywhere. They're probably still in the car. Up here we have some English muffins, fettuccine noodles, dumpling noodles, some bread for the boys' sandwiches, the candy they picked out, Swedish fish, and sour patch. Had a whole bunch of ramen noodles. I know, they're bad for you. Sometimes mommy's too lazy to make herself some lunch, so. Some of this orange juice. If you haven't tried this and you can find it, it tastes just like Sunny D. And it's only like $1.98 for this whole giant jug. Then we have some corn tortillas, some flour ones, and some extra large ones. Some tostada shells. Got some of these chocolate and vanilla cookies for the boys. Peanut butter filled pretzels. Some jalapeno kettle chips. And some onion rings. And for produce, we got a ton. Let's see what we got. We got some red potatoes. Texas born and red. Got some red delicious apples. Those are what we picked out. Some baby carrots. Some rainbow carrots. Fresh green beans. A big bag of kale. A whole bunch of bananas, some avocados, lemons, two big onions. We've got some regular white mushrooms and some baby bellas. Green onions, some cilantro, and some red seedless grapes. This is a whole bunch of stuff that I have to find room for in there. Somehow most of this produce needs to go in the fridge. So that's gonna do it for this haul, guys. If you haven't already, please subscribe down below and hit that notification bell so you see every time we have a little video. Thank you guys so much for watching and I hope you enjoyed. So this is one of the drawbacks of once a month grocery shopping when you have a tiny kitchen and no actual pantry. We use this china cabinet to keep all of our food in and it works okay, but it's kind of crammed full. Everything is just kind of shoved in. This is all of our pasta and rice and stuff like that. And then we have the cabinet with all the breakfast items and some baking things. And these are all of the canned goods and sauces and that kind of thing. I still have a few things to put away, so I gotta find room for those. And our fridge and freezer is absolutely bursting at the seams. The freezer's full of meat and veggies, and the fridge is full of everything else.